Hello and welcome my beautiful Scorpio Minds today to another pole dance, lyrical dance performance choreography. Today here from my super sunny um, living room <laughs> or one room as you want. Yeah, today we're gonna be learning something on the spinning pole. <laughs> of course, you can also do this on static if you're not super comfortable. Then, um, yeah, just do everything but without the spin. No worries here. For me, my pole doesn't spin so well because it's already old and it makes like cracking sounds. It actually doesn't do now, but usually it does. <laughs> so don't get confused or weirded out by that. Um, yeah, I would say we'll get started. I have like a little combo up on the pole and then there's also like a little flow down below. Um, we'll start with the thing up on the pole just so you get used to it a little bit. I hope you're warmed up because you want to like stick on the pole. So if not, go ahead, do like 10 minutes of warming up, jumping around, doing like something on the pole so that it gets warm and then you come right back so we can learn this choreography. If you've been doing the other choreographies here on my channel, you know how it's gonna go down. I'm gonna explain you the moves step by step, then we'll do it with music, with counting, and then without counting. And um, everything I will do once. So if you haven't gotten it yet, if you want more explanation, then just go back. Go back the little scenario, the little explanations that I'm giving, and then you can progress from here, but I just don't want to make this video enormously long. All right, so here we go. The music will be starting, it will be playing, we'll be doing a little um, down below, on the floor kind of thing. And, oh yeah, I'm gonna show you what it looks like first. Here we go. It's too late now to turn around and back again I made my bed and now I lay my head in it And I'm sorry I'm not perfect but I knew that I wouldn't be I guess it's for the best you know the worst first so that you kind of know what is coming your way but basically what we're doing is we're going from an um, outside leg hook all right so it's this one so if you haven't been doing inwards then this is not the choreo for you go back I already have like two other choreos up where you don't need inwards but if you're already there this is perfect so what we're gonna do is we'll come from an invert outside leg hook and then when you're here you really want to bring your hip up so that it's facing the ceiling so that you can release your lower arm and I am grabbing the back of my knee and you can also release your upper arm but this is basically only style so you decide for yourself how much you want to let go all right if you don't feel comfortable letting go your top arm it's completely fine. It's also based on how much grip you have. All right, from there, I will show it to you on the bottom, I guess. So from here, you are hooked. 
you are here and you're down whoop like that all right so your grab grip points is your knee pad and also here your um your waist all right so when we're here you want to pull yourself up so that your hips are facing the ceiling you can do this with me by the way and then let everything go until you're hanging here and then we'll just be super pretty while it's spinning <laughs> and then when the time comes ooh, this is gonna be hard on the floor but when the time comes you want to grip up you can use your leg to pull yourself down and of course your core muscles and then you want to pull yourself up you want to bring that leg what's behind me to the front so that it's here into a martini sit. So what you're doing when you're here, you want to bring that leg in front. You want to let the pole get on your thigh, basically almost on your butt here, but you're still hooking with your upper leg. Then you want to bring your outside arm or your inside arm basically, the one that's been holding on, into your armpit, uh, not armpit, to your elbow, and then grab behind your knee again until you're here into a martini. And then we'll spin again, we'll spin, spin, spin. I'll go over this again, but just so you have this like, kind of like notion in your head, all right? And then you want to grab again re-grab, let that bottom leg be loose again and then it wants to slide down the pole, go into the other direction again and then you want to basically simply let go and now it's impossible to explain it on the floor <laughs> but then what we're going to do is we'll just basically turn um, around so that you will be, be here <laughs> on the floor all right, but I'll explain it to you once we get there, make sure to clean your pole so that you're not sliding down. And I'll explain it to you once again on the pole and you can do this with me. So get into an outside leg hang. For me, it's the right leg. Go up, hook. And here you see, I'm turning my hips up. So that they're facing the ceiling. Now here you want to really squeeze your bicep into the pole, reach at the back of your leg, hope you can still see me, the back of your leg and then you can let go, grabbing the pole or just letting loose basically. What you want to do now, you want to let go of that arm, re-grab, pull yourself high and then from here, let me turn around, you want to bring that leg to the other side all right let me face you so when you're here you're hanging you are grabbing high you still have your your hand here so you can push yourself away reach up this leg stays and you just bring knee to knee until you can grab and open all right, this is your martini sit. We'll just stay here for a little bit. Then we grab with that outside hand. We grab with the other hand. You can also come between your legs again and let yourself fall down. All right, from here, you can put that foot on your knee, spin your belly towards the pole and simply let yourself slide down and come down. Whew. All right, of course we're doing this in a spinning motion. So in the song, in the choreography, we'll be taking like a step, we'll be taking a step. And from here, you want to have your inside hand below and your outside leg uh, hand up. And then basically what you want to do, you want to bring a little bit momentum, not too much because it's spinning, towards your pull, and then you can pull yourself up. So we're taking like a, a step here, a step, re-grab, and then from here, whee, you can spin. 
and I love to basically just have my right leg up but this is all your choice again um, however you feel it's pretty it's nice but it makes it a little bit easier to then open up the two straddle all right so it's from here we take a step we take another step and we grab give yourself that momentum by spinning into the pole drawing yourself into the pole pivoting on that inside leg drawing yourself up all right then you're here and then you want to open up and hook all right Whew. try it out and also here with the um, invert you can choose if you want to do it straight leg or I just did it bent leg which is a bit easier but of course if you're here you can do it straight and then hook and then put your pelvis to the ceiling and up all right give it a try give it a try I'm going to do it with you all right but we're basically just going to do the hook thing and then we'll see how far we can go all right here we go stand beside your pole one hand is up you take a step with the inside leg take a step with the outside leg switch your arms pivot yourself into the pole give yourself momentum and spin spin so spin and invert 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 and hook pelvis to the ceiling grab your leg let go of the other hand Whew. from here you want to grab with your inside hand pull yourself up bring that foot around grab with your inside hand bring that knee towards knee and let go also when you're here in martini again grab with your outside hand now grab 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 let that foot swing around you can grab between your legs let yourself fall back in here close it up and let yourself slide down and come down all right this is like a little bit scary at first so hold on to the pole you can hold on when you're here um your pole towards your belly okay so just hold on you don't have to let go immediately all right so that's the up pole thing <laughs> the upper pole flow high pole flow and now we're going to be starting with the low pole flow so what's happening here is we've got like a count of four until the music starts so we're here we grab our pole high I'm going to be starting on my right side of grabbing with my left hand and there are going to be snaps on the music I'm going to give you the cues later but there are going to be snaps just so you know so what we want to do is we want to step and snap step and snap step and snap and step and snap now what's going to happen is we've got a little bit of time we really want to take things slow in this choreography so what we want to do is with our inside leg we want to take a big step in front of the pole while reaching down with our right hand holding on to the pole taking a big step back with that uh, outside leg and then sliding down until we can put our hand on the floor awesome so this is the first thing now with that front leg you want to draw a big 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 circle until you're back and you're on a bridge and you can reach up and down with your other hand bringing your right leg into this triangle shape now you want to turn back into your bridge right here pulling your leg up all right from here you want to bring yourself to the front with a little momentum basically sliding onto your knees re-grabbing so your right hand slides down a little the left hand comes up pivot step come up russian twist or russian turn so for that your left hand goes up with your pink with your pinky finger sliding up you want to dive 
through the arm, so through your armpit, pivoting on that front knee. And now we're in a transition of almost going into the air. But first you want to take a step, switch, take a step, and now you take that momentum with you, turning into the pole and getting into the spin. Stay here for a second, opening up, hook your leg, bring your pelvis to the ceiling, grab your thigh, release. We'll stay here for a second before you re-grab, bring yourself up, re-grab, bring that leg to the front, knee towards knee, and release. From here, you re-grab, you re-grab, you bring that leg to the other side and let yourself fall down. <laughs> now you close everything off and let yourself slide down before you release everything. Now, that's the whole flow. It's really not that difficult. It's really just with timing that we make it pretty. From here, we can be done if you don't want to continue or we can do the whole little um, flow we did before again but on the other side. So from here when it came down you want to reach high with your right hand, you want to take a step, snap, step, snap, step, snap with your inside leg. Take a big step forward, you're spiraling down with your left hand reaching for the pole, your outside leg takes a big step back, sliding down until you're on the floor. That front leg is gonna circle, circle, circle until it's at the back. Reach down, grab up, other hand comes to the floor, coming into this triangle shape. From here, that left leg is gonna come back again, reaching up, coming down, and sliding yourself to the pole. And that will be it. That will be it for, for today. I think that's enough. All right, clean your pole. And then we'll get started with the music. I highly encourage you to do this one a couple times until you kind of got it before starting with the music. Because it's, it's not tricky, but it's kind of hard to get everything into your brain, but we're going to do it again. The song is called Good by Above Envy. I found it on Artlist, just where I get all my music. Um, I'm going to put the link down below if I find it on YouTube, um, so that you can work with it over and over again. Get set, get on your pole. We're going to get started right away. There's like a count of two before we start. Um, so right after the first snap, here we go. And step, snap, step, snap, step, snap. It's Inside leg, spiral, step, slide down. Front leg goes back, bridge. And grab up. Come back, and up. And to the front. I guess it's for the Bring yourself up. You know, and rush and twist. Step. Step. And up. And hook. Grab your thigh. And stay. Regrab. Into marching. And smile. Grab, bring that leg to the side, and slide down, and release. Snap, 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 inside leg, big step, rotate. Yay, that was 
was awesome. Let's do it again. This is so nice. I love it. Awesome, you guys. Let's do it again. I got confused at the end, so we'll just simply do it again for the brain, for the mind. Ooh, grab some water, clean your pole, clean your hands, whatever you need to right now. And then we'll do it again with the music. And I'm going to count a little bit, not too much, but just so you kind of get used to the count of the music. All right. Here we go. We're going to be starting right away. Step. It's too late now to turn around and back. Big again. step. Down, down, down. Circle. Bridge. Re grab. Angle. Back to the bridge. Leg up. Down. Spiral to the front. And get up. American turn. Step. Step. And up. Up. And hook. Bring pelvis to the front. And we grab. Bring that leg to the front. Knee to knee, release. Martini, smile. We grab. Let yourself slide down. And back down. So I can listen back again And I'm sorry I'm not perfect But I knew that I wouldn't be I guess it's for the best You know the worst to me Yes, you got it as I said before, do this one a couple of times. You really get to know the music, really get to know your body, the movements until you got it down. The bottom stuff is not super easy. Um, so if you want, I can go over it again very quickly. And then we'll go into the, I'm not saying anything, music part. <laughs> All right, so when we're standing here, you're standing on your left side. And you want to take a step with your inside snap, outside snap, inside snap. Now you've got a little bit of time, so I'm going to take like another little step here before I step my inside way back or way to the front. Grab with my right hand and take a step with my outside leg until I'm here. From here, you want to draw a super big circle with the foot that's in front, all the way back until you can come into a back bend. From here, you want to grab above your other hand, the lower hand comes down, and you want to keep spiraling with that right leg until that hip meets the pole. From here, you simply want to go back into the bridge action, and lift that leg up, if it's possible. If not, then that's completely fine. Bring it down with a straight leg. You want to come in front of the pole, grab up, and come up. Russian turn, no, American turn. Take a step, take a step, and from here you want to straight away come into the spinning motion. All right, I hope that's a little bit more clearer now. Let's get into the music part. All right, guys, we're going to start straight away. I'm not going to be counting. If you need more cues and stuff like that, go back to like the beginning, learn all the moves when they follow each other, what's coming next and stuff like that. And once you've got that down, come back here with the music and I'm gonna let the music play a little bit longer so you can also do your own freestyle or try the trick again. Whatever it is that you want to, let's get started. There are like two counts on the snap and then we'll start, but you already know that. <laughs> All right, are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. It's 
too late now to turn around and back again I made my bed and now I lay my head in it And I'm sorry I'm not perfect but I knew that I wouldn't be I guess it's for the best, you know the worst I'm no good at being good, but I never said I was 